Welcome back to Officer Oil. My name's Scott McAdoo. I'm a police first responder. When I'm not fighting crime, I'm fighting friction. Today, I am excited to start my brand new steel MS-251 Wood Boss Chainsaw. Brand new, super pumped, never been run, shiny clean. I'm getting ready to fill it up with the Amsoil Saber Professional Synthetic Two-Stroke Oil as well as our semi-synthetic bar and chain oil. Getting ready to do that. Now the folks over at the dealer know how particular I am about my equipment. They know that I bleed Amsoil and there are several, several reasons why. The short answer is running Amsoil will save you time and money. It will better protect your equipment. It will last longer everything you're looking for it's going to be reliable and when you go to when you need that chainsaw it's going to fire up and it's going to last a super super long time so whoever when i go down the road and decide to rotate get some new equipment whoever picks a saw up is going to get a really really good saw so hopefully you watch this you'll see how well i take care of this so they know everybody knows that i only run amsoil on this so brand new again completely shiny brand new Never been run, never been started up, super, super clean. Here's my fuel tank. Look at that, nothing in there. Bone dry, bone dry in there. And same thing with my barn chain oil, nothing in there as well. So today I'm going to be filling it up with my Amsoil already mixed my two and a half gallon can here Saber Professional synthetic two stroke oil I wrote it on here wrote it on the can to want so I know that I'm not grabbing the gas versus my premix yes folks that says 100 to 1 this is what I use this is my best recommendation this is what I've used since I became became since I drank the Amsoil Kool-Aid back in 2008 has never let me down I have never had to clean a, an exhaust port clean spark arresters, anything like that, because it runs so much cleaner. That is the Amsoil Synthetic Professional, or the set, or Synthetic Saber Professional two-stroke oil. So right here, look at that, one ratio, one oil covers all ratios. So whether it's 32 to one, 40 to one, 50 to one, 80 to one, or my preferred 100 to one, you are covered. So, so super low smoke, all right, it's gonna got, it has a stabilizer in there. Again, saving you time and money on the back here. Here's all those recommendations. So it meets all the latest JSOFD specs. So perfect for your Echoes, your Shindawas, your Steels, your Huskies. You name it, it covers it. So all your mix ratios. Okay. We have it in several, several mix uh, package sizes. So we've got the pillow pack. Perfect for the one gallon can for the small homeowner. Mix, tear this off, one gallon of fuel right there. This is what I use. I put a little cheat sheet on it there. I give these out as samples to clients. And this is perfect. All you need, three and a half ounce bottle for a two and a half gallon can. And then the eight ounce is great for the five gallon can right there. Perfect. But we also have it packaged at in quart bottles, in gallon jugs, as well as in bulk. So if you have a big fleet, you need a lot of two stroke, a lot of two stroke needs. The bulk's gonna be the way to go. Somebody's out there ripping. So it's gonna be the way to go for mixing up big, larger quantities of gas. So I'm also gonna be using the Amsoil semi-synthetic bar and chain oil here, okay? Super anti-wear additives to adhere to the bar better. It's not gonna fling off as fast. You're not gonna have to replace your bars as quickly. You're gonna put give a little better pressure on the bar. It is just going to save you time and money and not have to re replace that equipment. All season formula works great in the coldest days. We are headquartered in Wisconsin. We certainly know cold. And here's the back of the bottle there, right? Super, super, super high tack formula. And I'm going to show you that here in a second, okay? Biggest complaint I get about is that in the winter time, it just doesn't work too well because it gets so thick. Not the case with us. So in the coldest days, it's going to pour and flow great. So let's get this thing filled up here. All right, so let me see if I can do this one-handed. 
My son, Garrett, junior officer oil, is usually helping me, but he decided to go to the swimming pool today. All right, so let's get this thing in here. Let the air out of that. There we go. Filled up. Filled up there. I don't know if you can see, it's got a nice little dye to it, got a nice little color so that you know that it is mixed. I love that, even at 100 to 1. All right, let me get that on there. Okay, that is locked. And I want to show you, I want to tell you why. I want to tell you why I use the Amsoil Saber Pro. There's an incredible study that we did that is so powerful. I love sharing it because it really, the proof's in the pudding and it just really, really highlights the benefits here. Let me show you that. All right, so little different application. Now this is an echo string, string trimmer study. Now it's got a little age on it. All right, March, 2017. But I tell you the results here when I show you are super, super incredible. So what we did, Amsoil went out and bought eight Echo SRM225 trimmers, okay? And they ran four of them with the Amsoil Saber Professional synthetic two-stroke oil. And they ran four of them with the Echo Power Blend oil, all right? They ran them for 300 hours, 150 at mid-throttle, 75 at idle, 75 wide open. Same fuel, same temperature, everything was a push. We just used different oil, okay? At the Here's a show kind of what it looked like. So they just kept feeding it fuel. They put a rubber band on the trigger and just tested it for the 300 hours. At the end of the 300 hours, they tore the motors apart. Look at these piston rings and skirts. Look at the difference. Amsoil. Echo. Piston crowns, under crowns. Amsoil. Echo. Wrist pin bearings, okay. This is what we see though, folks, right here, these exhaust ports. Look at this, 76% clogging. Comment below, tell me if you've ever seen this on your trimmers, on your handheld, your saws, your blowers, anything two stroke, if you've seen this on the exhaust ports. Well, guess what? I have never seen this on my two stroke equipment, ever. This is why I love it. I bleed the Amsoil Saber Pro. Spark arrestor screens. Most people I talk to tell me they just take them off. Hey, I don't blame you. Other than the fact we might start a forest fire. Look, 76% clogging. Look at this. Look at these heavy deposits, 293 hours, okay? Over here on the Amsoil side, the worst we had was 5%. You tell me, which would you go with? Main bearings, clean. Amsoil, echo. Crankcases. Amsoil, Echo. Check this out. Over here at the, the RPMs. RPM started to fall because this thing can't exhaust. It can't breathe, right? Can't exhale. Over the 300 hours, RPM start to fall with the Echo, the Amsoil. Stayed nice and consistent. Same thing down here with spark plug temps. Can't exhaust. It falls over the 300 hours. And the Amsoil stayed consistent. And by the way, folks, Amsoil did it with half as much oil. Half as much oil. Saving almost 50% in doing this study. All right, this is why, this is why I run Amsoil in everything I have. That's synthetic two-stroke oil. The proof is in the pudding. All right, so back to our semi-synthetic bar and chain oil. Amsoil is a synthetic company, and we have just a couple things that are not 100% synthetic. This is one of them. Now, I will mention, this is the older bottle, okay? This is the new label. This is the old label. I still have a bunch left of it. Using it up, same great formula. You can see even the darn mice got in here and chewed this thing up. All right, so lucky they didn't get through it there. But look how tacky. You see the tack on that? It's pretty warm out here, folks, and you can still see the tackiness of that. So let's get this, let this, let's get this thing poured in here. And there we go. Get that filled up. 
There we go. Let me get my cap on. Okay, boom. Come back here, put this on. So I'm getting ready to start this thing. Now, let me ask you, I, this is my first time using the Wood Boss, the uh, MS-251. Let me know if there's anything in particular that, you know, maybe you have one. Comment below. Tell me if there's something I need to watch out for, anything like that, just to get the longest life out of this thing. Obviously, I'm protecting with AMZO, but maybe there's something else. Little hints, tips, tricks, tips, you know, do's and don'ts, all the above. So let me know. So let's get this thing fired up now. I can't wait anymore. All right, so down pull the trigger pull the trigger push down here all the way down lock that in nice easy pull said no more than three times go back to one click Nice easy pull. Alright, so here we go. Got it down, all the way down. Between my legs here, nice easy pull. Okay, come up one click. Let's see here. There we go. First time starting. Gotta get used to that operate get it, get used to that uh, starting procedure from the old song. No push ball on it. There it is, fired up. <laughs> Let's try this again here. There we go. All right, so got my new steel saw, got my Amsoil Saber Pro in there, my semi synthetic bar and chain oil, and Oh, and one thing I forgot to tell you, to give you a little context. In my fuel can, I always run the Amsoil Quick Shot. It's an ethanol fuel treatment, clean out, cleans out any of those performance robbing deposits in your fuel system, in your carburetor, and it's, it keeps them out of there. It stabilizes the gas. It is an absolute must. My equipment will sit and sit for many, many months, fires right up. And then I always even give everything a little splash of the Amsoil gasoline stabilizer for extra, extra added protection for long long longer term storage as well so always use that as well that's what's in the new wood boss chainsaw now so if you want to start protecting your handheld equipment better upgrade to amsoil if you're a small homeowner do-it-yourselfer like me we have a great program called the preferred customer program it's going to save you 25% off of our retail price, give you drop, drop ship right to your doorstep, free shipping, anything over $100. Great program. We offer several other perks to go with it. If you have a fleet of saws, of you know other handheld equipment, two-stroke equipment, maybe municipal, commercial, I love working with tree and landscape clients. I work with ton, a ton of them. They're great people, and we've been able to save them so much time and money by doing this. Um, we have an even more advantageous program. We can get you an even bigger discount, better perks, as well as if you have a retail shop, maybe a repair shop, a retail store, we can get you a bigger discount, even more perks as well. Reach out to me. Happy to tell you more about it. I'm going to have links below to get that. 
can always go through my website, real easy to find, officeroil.com. Again, www.officeroil.com. And if you move forward, please plug in my referral number. My referral number is 164 9274. Again, 164 9274. By doing that, you'll be working with me. It helps support my family. Really does mean a lot. So thank you so much. But looking for comments below, looking for those likes. Please subscribe. Please share. Looking for other things I can do to help build the page. Having a lot of fun. Again, my son usually helps me, but he decided to go to the pool right now. Can't blame him at all. He's six. So, but thank you, and we'll look forward to seeing you next time. Officer Oil is out.